Okay, so I put a tap a line on this R290 compressor. Uh, right where the compressor is, 73 degrees. The room is 80 degrees, so we just got an air conditioner blowing on us that's up there. Um, so somewhere between 73 and 80 degrees, the pressure needs to be. Uh, on a pressure temperature chart for R290, uh, 73 degrees is going to be about 115 pounds pressure. So if this gauge, this is the pressure part right here, the blue. This gauge goes to 120. If this gauge doesn't wrap all the way out to 115 to 120, if it sits anywhere down below that, we'll know that we have no liquid in this. Or if it doesn't move at all, we know we have no nothing in it at all. But um, if it wraps all the way out and goes to 115 to 120 or even more, we know we have at least a bunch of liquid in it, but we don't know how much. So it's a good indication indicator. Uh, it's one indicator uh, that you can use to see if you have refrigerant in the system. Uh, so let's let's open this thing up. And first, we uh, screw the tap line all the way down. It's all the way tightened down. And then we back it off. Aha! I was right. We have a leak. Only 65 pounds pressure in that system. This is a very good test to do. So that means we only have vapor. Uh, we have no liquid uh, propane. So, and this thing has to have a few, it has to take a few ounces. I'll look at the tag. But that's why it was freezing up a while ago. And that's, that helped burn out the compressor, the 98 degree room. And then you don't have enough refrigerant in the compressor. You get high superheat. You don't have enough suction cooling coming back to cool the compressor windings. And you end up with dead compressor. So this is... Yep, so this is a Multiple Offender Deluxe. Uh, so we have... Oh, come on. Anyways, we only 66 pounds pressure. I don't know what that... You guys can look up on our, our R290 chart, but that's going to be... I don't... It's going to be... Uh, yeah. No good. So... Uh, Yep, all right, so that's all she wrote. We got a leak, and we got a 2019, so it's a, the Hoshijaki only lasted from 3-26-2019 till 8, oh, beginning of 8, let's call it 8, 8-7, eight, 2025. So... Oh, we're not using, it's not in, not a condensate loop because we don't have a condensate loop there. Um, most likely evaporator uh, inside because of something. Uh, okay, uh, so that's all she wrote. I'm not going to even fix this thing. But if you got one leak, you got another leak coming down the, down the pipe. And the thing's done. So, rest in peace. Uh, new unit, uh, not worth repairing this thing, cost way more than, yeah, so, yeah, just get a, just get a cheapo $2,000 Avantco and go another five years, better way to go, I saw the things online for a couple grand, 2200 bucks, better way to go, yeah, don't want to put, Door hinges are gone on this thing too. It needs door gaskets. It's done. All right. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks a lot for watching. Click like on the video. Subscribe. Take care. Bye.